Jay, you mentioned once before in another session about Rampa. Um, I, have some, I have some people who are on this journey and I'm trying to tell them about this, but they've sort of said, no, this guy doesn't know what he's talking about. You know. um, and I mentioned that you had said once before that Rampa's gone on to the divine love path. Can you just expand on that for a moment? Um, Why are they well, still thinking? They're still thinking <coughs> that, that nothing's changed and they've still got the same release and still going to be stuck. Well, Ramtha's primary channel on Earth was Jay-Z Knight, the lady who appeared in the Down the Rabbit Hole movie and I think The Secret, yeah, the secret perhaps she was in too. I can't remember. Yeah, in the she secret. Was yeah she was in The Secret, yeah. Um, now, she, she was channeling Ramtha and Ramtha was on the natural love path. Ramtha... Um, Obviously, got in, he's been in the spirit world for tens of thousands of years. I think about 45, 45,000 years. Um, and, and so he was obviously on the natural love path for a long time. And he uh, began focusing a lot of his intention on the earth. Uh, he had a deep desire to help people on earth. So what he did was he searched for a channel that he could use. And what he did is he found a channel, JZ9, who he could use. And he overcloaked her in such a manner that she could, you could see when he enters her and when he exits. So she started channeling all this truth that Ramtha had from the sixth sphere. And, uh, and as a process, she obviously becomes very, very linked with the spirit who is guiding her, right? Very, very linked. So the two of them become very linked. And, and Ramtha is not like other sixth sphere spirits who have completely overcloaked a person. So there are many... Uh, Indian gurus, for example, that a six-fear spirit has completely overcloaked them. In their day-to-day -day life, they are the six-fear spirit most of the time. Right? But what JZ would do is she would ch channel Grantha, and he would overcloak her for periods of time, and uh, then she would channel and then he would exit. And she, you would see the differences in, in, in her as, as these transformations occurred. But in those channeling phases, she tra she's transmitted lots and lots of information from Ramtha. Lots of uh, what you would classify as high metaphysical, spiritual based information. Very intellectual. And all of the followers of Ramtha are, are very, very focused on the development of the metaphysical gifts uh, the, and using the intellect rather than the emotion. Now that's been going on for many years, and then when, when Ramtha actually, when I spoke with Ramtha and he investigated the Divine Love Path, he moved on the Divine Love Path with his soulmate, by the way, very, very rapidly. Now, the problem with that is his channel, Jay Z Knight, is still on the natural love path, not receiving divine love. So can she now channel him as he is? Obviously, based on what I've been describing about the laws of report already, she can't. So what's happened is that Ramtha began trying to channel to her more emotional material over a period of nearly one year. She became very emotional and quite sick during that process, Jay-Z Knight, because she was very, very resistive to actually dealing with her emotions about it. And Ramtha then felt like he was just damaging her physically. Uh, by doing that. And so he steps back. Now in the process of stepping back, we've got a beautifully uh, prepared medium who's used to tra transmitting lots and lots of metaphysical information and, uh, and he's there transmitting this metaphysical information and she's receiving it really well because she's really well developed in that regard. And so what happens now is another spirit who's in a similar state to what Ramtha was has the ability to actually just step in. Who has a similar character and nature to him, of course, because otherwise she would feel the difference, most probably. And so that's what actually happened. Uh, over a year ago now. Yeah, she went through, well, yeah, she went through a period of transition where she was feeling quite sick and ill and not understanding it. Um, she actually counselled some events uh, during this process and didn't understand why she needed to... She didn't understand for the first time in this whole process she was actually getting sick and she didn't understand that either. And the reason why was because a, a celestial spirit will no longer maintain your physical body for you. Uh, 
Uh, so Celestial Spirit wants to teach you how to maintain your own body rather than use their energy to maintain your body. And so that causes a huge change in the person who's channeling. Now, I'm very certain that JZ Knight understands this has happened to her and that something is up. She understands something is different. But she also has some people surrounding her who obviously there's a, an enterprise now um, very, very much focused on receiving messages from Ramtha. And when the problem, the problem with an enterprise is that it tends to gain its own momentum. And unless a person, the channeler herself, is in a very, very strong condition and not worried about the money or the ostracism that may result, and, and, and actually is willing to continue with the truth, she'll be very, very drawn into continuing it, convincing herself that she doesn't understand what just happened. And that's exactly what's going on at the moment.